Hey folks, and welcome to another installment of Dave's Impressions. This time around, Paradigm. These impressions were taken from playing the game for around 30 minutes. Enjoy! Paradigm is a bit quirky. I think it's going for an absurdist vibe, what with the beatboxing eggplant, the computer with the Australian accent, and the sloth who seems to be the head of a large evil multinational corporation. That last part might have a redundancy in it. It's definitely playing itself for comedy, and right here is where Paradigm will either delight or put you off. Comedy, especially in games, is highly subjective. And the problem with a lot of comedy games is that if the humor doesn't work for you, since most of the game is centered around making you laugh, you're not going to enjoy yourself. Paradigm's jokes are rapid fire. As this is a point-and-click adventure game, the majority of the humor comes from looking at world objects and talking to other characters. There are plenty of objects to look at and each line has been tailored for a joke. This approach is likely, so if one joke doesn't land, maybe the next one will. At the beginning, I thought Paradigm was trying too hard to be funny. None of it was landing either, well, except for when the game asked me if I wanted to watch the dog tutorial. That got a bark of laughter out of me. The more I played, the more jokes started landing, and the more I started to appreciate this strange world and its characters. I think the pacing helps too. The puzzles play second to all the humor, and each screen seems to have one primary objective before moving on to the next. Even the overall motivation for the game is simple. Paradigm just wants to compose some fat beats. This also means, for instance, that while figuring out how to distract the junkie from his cardboard TV full of rats, I was walking around and just enjoying the lines of dialogue before giving the actual problem any thought. In the end, I think your enjoyment here will be entirely contingent on your sense of humor and your affinity for the point-and-click genre. Thanks for watching.